Wrestling fans are not happy about this story right here. This lady, Farrah Abraham, she's officially training to wrestle. We're going to talk about it. ProWrestlingSheet.com so she she teased it recently. I remember it was teased. Yeah. A wrestling company said they had signed her, and then there was kind of some confusion over whether Farrah Abraham was actually going to be wrestling. Uh, she's an MTV star, for those of you who are unaware. Now, uh, we got a video from over the weekend where she was interviewed, and she talked about taking bumps. She said she's officially training, uh, that it's actually difficult to take bumps in the ring. I didn't expect her to be training. Uh, when I put the story up, though, Roka and many others were immediately outraged. Roka, why are you so against Farrah Abraham getting into the world of wrestling? Look, this is ridiculous. I mean, what are we talking about? This is a woman doing porn. Is she going to jump in and do wrestling? Like, it's it's an insult to the business, to the industry. It isn't like wrestling is struggling, and so they need to, like, make a big signing for a social for an influencer, quote-unquote, like Farrah Abraham. I mean, it's so ridiculous. And the way she spoke about it, yeah, I'm taking some bumps, I'm learning. All of it was just, when you see the how Ronda Rousey did it versus how Farrah Abraham did it, those are two different spectrums, right? Ronda comes in with a pedigree of fighting, but she's beloved by people in the back, in the back, uh, uh, in the back with uh, in the locker room, rather respected. Back, respected a lot. Whereas Vera will come in, and you know she's going to start shit with somebody, start crap with somebody, and have the drama because this one seeks attention no matter what she's doing. And so this would just, I think this, I mean, and if you're appealing to kids who are in the front row watching this stuff, why are you having this person be a part of your brand? It wouldn't make sense. Now, look, at, I agree with you that uh, the, the the parallels, yeah, are very. Ronda's the right way of doing right. things. Uh, I think for me, look, at, I I in no way am excited about Fair Abraham getting into <laughs> professional wrestling. Uh, one, I was telling Rogue before we started recording, I love seeing the outrage when I post these stories. The Fair people are outraged yes. when it comes to Fair Abraham. So it's funny to see the barrage of gifts that reply to every story about <laughs> Fair Abraham getting into the world of wrestling. But if she is dedicated to doing it, I do want to cover it. I mean, I am covering right. professional wrestling. I have to cover these things. True. Uh, but... I agree with everyone else that there's no passion here. I mean, uh, wrestling, you have to be on the road 24 seven. You have to give up your life. You have to give up so many things. Fair Abraham's not gonna do that. No. Fair Abraham is clearly trying to get some publicity off of something that she sees a big fan base attached to and thinks that, well, it's something I haven't done yet, yeah. so I'm gonna try to do that. Uh, for my time at TMZ, I know <laughs> that there are not a lot of things that Farrah Abraham does with genuine emotion behind it. She's not capable of it. <laughs> okay, well, we wanna hear from you guys. Uh, tell us what you think about Farrah Abraham officially trained to wrestle. Hit us up on social media. It's at Wrestling Sheet on Facebook, on Twitter, and on Instagram. Uh, he's at the Roca Says. I'm at Ryan Satin. And please, while you're here, subscribe down below. Uh, like the video. Share it if it's something that you're interested in. It helps us out. It keeps us alive. It keeps us going here at Wrestling Sheet. I'm trying to continually uh, put video content out for you guys. So please help me out in return by hitting that subscribe button. Okay, that's it. We're done. Officially tapping out for now. Until next time, stay out of the dirt and keep your eye on the sheet. ProWrestlingSheet.com